Hello everyone, Brandon here. It's time for a Lincoln, California Homes for Sale market update through September 2022. Let's get started. Okay, so what's happening in Lincoln right now? We are seeing 180 homes on the market. Last month, there were 173 homes actively for sale. The month before that, 217. We are seeing more and more houses flood the market. Why is that? Well, interest rates are higher, right? We look at a year ago, we were at 119 homes available. For pendings, right now we have 94 homes pending. Uh, a year ago, we had 103 pending. As far as sold, we had 80 homes sold last month. The month before that, 102. So we're seeing less homes for sale. We're seeing more homes active. There are a lot of reasons for that and stay tuned to the end of the video so I can tell you all about it. All right, let's look at the average price per square foot in Lincoln. Right now we're at 331. It's actually up $10 from last month per square foot. Now, why is that? It could be because uh, we're dealing with small square foot houses, large square foot houses, all the single family residences in Lincoln, and maybe some of the, uh, some of the higher ones sold. Uh, either way, seeing a fluctua fluctuation like that is a good thing. This time last year, we were at $318 a square foot. So uh, what I like about Lincoln's price per square foot is it stays pretty consistent. As we look at the average sold price versus the original list price, uh, we are, houses are selling for 96% of what they're listed for. Previous month, 96. One before that, 97. One before that, 99. We're seeing them go down slightly, and a lot of that is due to the time of the year. It's due to the interest rates being higher. There are a lot of factors to that but we need to continue to watch that. I see it going down another few percent in the next few months before interest rates uh, tend to go down. Right now, let's look at average days on market. How long does it take a house to go from active to pending? We are at 33 months in Lincoln. Keep in mind, we're reaching that holiday season. Uh, like I said, the buyer pool has dwindled. Uh, those are some of the contributing factors. No cause for alarm. Uh, it's very important to, uh, to be able to sell your house in a timely manner, but as of right now, anything from that two to, to five week period is acceptable. Now let's look at the average sold price in Lincoln through September. We're at $670,000. Now that is up from 647 last month. Again, Lincoln consists of so many different types of homes. We have houses in Old Town Lincoln. We have brand new homes. We have multi-million dollar homes. We have homes in uh, Sun City and, and the golf course. So there are a lot of different uh, prices and types of homes. So we tend to see uh, Lincoln's uh, average sales price go up more than go down. It stays pretty solid, pretty consistent. Hot take for sellers. Be willing to negotiate. We gotta make sure that we are pricing the house right at the beginning. I could not stress this enough. Pricing the house right at the beginning is important. So get together with your trusted real estate professional. Make sure that you are pricing the house competitively based on not just what's sold, but what's active on the market right now. Very, very important. Not only that, doing reports before listing your house right now can help set you up to market the house properly, to be able to make the most amount of money. So that when a buyer commits to buy your house, they actually follow through. Because what we're seeing right now is we're seeing buyers committing to buying a house, interest rates go up, they may uh, find some things that they want fixed on the house, ask the seller to do it. The seller maybe doesn't agree to those repairs. Now the buyer is faced with paying $200 more per month because interest rates have gone up than they agreed to pay when they agreed to buy the house. So if all that makes sense, buyers are being put in a tough position. And so sellers need to be willing and able to negotiate so that they can sell their house. And the goal is always to sell for top dollar and if you like some more tips on how to do that, feel free to send me a direct message or reach out to me. So hot buyer tip. Buyers, there's almost no competition right now. Interest rates are high, yes, but competition is low. There are special interest rates where you can get grants uh, to get 10% towards your down payment and closing costs. There are special loan programs where you can get 2% under market interest rates. Uh, their opportunities are endless. So buyers, don't give up, get back in the game. Uh, my name is Brandon Leon with eXp Realty. I uh, look forward to helping you. If there's anything else, any other numbers you'd like in uh, these videos that I do monthly, just uh, comment below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll see you next month.